ready. Buckle up. You ready to get out? Fender. What is up, you guys? It's so good to see you. It is so good to see you. Thanks for coming back. I got the AutoZam. I got the cappuccino. Yes, the AutoZam's got an issue. You should watch that now. Watch that now. Watch. Always a problem with something. Always a problem. The AutoZam has got a fender. It's got a crack in it. Took it off. Now we got to fix it. Fender. Let's, let's go fix it. Ah. Fix it. Ah. Uh. I don't have any tools to fix a fender. I'll try one more. Yes. Got what we need. Little cup full of water. Little fender. Little super glue. Just gonna fix it here in my workshop. Just gonna fix it. Sit here and hold it. Watch a little Clarkson's farm. Okay, right? I'm the best mechanic on YouTube, hands down. So the AutoZam has got a fender missing. It's going back on in this video, I think. It's going back on in this video. Cappuccino's got the oil leak. I got parts on order for that. We're gonna figure that one out. But, but, right here, right in this spot, this hole, there was a Honda Beat. It's gone. It's not gone, it's back. It's got wrapped. It looks so good. I'm so excited to show you. Let's go out front and look at it, okay? Come, 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 come. Right behind that garage door, are you ready? I'm ready, let's go, let's go. All right, I lied, I, I lied. It hasn't got wrapped, but today's the day. Today's the day it gets wrapped. We're going to wide open wraps right now, let's go. to get an all-inclusive resort experience review on the ABCs that I own and through technical difficulties um, just plain out being an amateur you're not gonna get that because um, if you were there in the last video you saw I got that really nice 360 camera on and did some fun stuff donuts and shenanigans um, but Audio didn't come through and then batteries died so you live and you learn I'm gonna take this opportunity to tell you about the beat though the beat how it differ how it differs from the other two is it is naturally aspirated there is no turbo which you know good bad ugly take it take it however you want to um, because you're dealing in such small displacements you're not lacking that much horsepower. If you had to name a more comfortable one, grand touring one of the three, this is gonna be it. There's a shelf behind my head here where the roof lays when it's down, but when it's not down, you can throw a bag up there, a duffel or two, um, go on a trip. So, you know, there's more interior space as far as like, I feel like there's more width to it a little more length as well on the inside um, so that just helps with daily usability if you were gonna daily a K car it wasn't like a, a van or anything it's got a funky interior and it's cool man it's a convertible really small convertible car I mean it's it's fun I enjoy it it's kind of under the radar you got to be in a certain mood to want to drive somewhere and get like just like you're getting hit by the paparazzi cameras snapping people hanging out their windows and that's what you get in the AutoZam and definitely the cappuccino now that it's wrapped so we're headed to the wrap shop at the beat and it might get rid of its Lacking 
some insulation. Uh, but we're headed to the wrap shop and it might get rid of its under the radarness. Um, but we'll see. I like it. Um, if I had to like slot it into where I would, you know, take it, I'm taking AutoZam first. And then it's a close second between this and the cappuccino. Um, the cappuccino definitely offers more from a driving standpoint, like a like spirited driving. But I don't know. You get the Honda reliability in this. So that's not fair. The cappuccino is messed up right now, so it, it wouldn't slot lower. But you get the Honda reliability. You get the ease of driving. It's just an enjoyable drive. More room, so you just feel less cramped. And um, overall, I, I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm putting it second right now. If you're in the Wilmington area and need a car wrapped, come to Wide Open. These guys will take care of you. They're just genuine car enthusiasts. They love it. They love what they do. And um, if I can get turned in here, we'll get this. We'll get this beat dropped off. Let's go in here and see what these boys are up to. Let's see if they can help me out. Yeah, I thought I heard a Honda beat out there. You did? Yeah, Is that man. what you heard? This is a little bit bigger. <laughs> so we're leaving the beat here. It's in good hands, I promise. The guys are going to take care of it. And it's going to be looking oh so fine. I'm going to get in my wife's ride, and she's going to take me out on a date. And by that, I mean we're going grocery shopping. So. We'll see you in a little bit. Fender. What's up guys? It's a new day. We're gonna put the Fender on the AutoZam. Hey Tux, are you gonna help? I don't know if he's gonna prove to be any help at all. <laughs> That's done, right? Doesn't that look good? That's how it's supposed to be? Okay, no, yeah. Now fender gaps are looking a little Tesla there. Yeah, we might have to do something. Took longer than it should have. Let's see. It didn't really, didn't really accomplish what, what I wanted it to. Still, you see that gap right there. That's the finger's width. And over here, it's a lot tighter. Well, at least the crack is fixed, and um, yeah, we'll work on the rest later. I don't know. special guest today Tux say hello Tux roll his window down decided to take my dog Tux for a ride in the AutoZam
thank goodness we're back. <laughs> he can't wait to get out. <laughs> Autozam life is not for tucks. No? You done? <laughs> uh.